At Argosy University, the administration and the students are actively involved in giving back to the community. Just recently, the Honolulu campus president, Dr. Warren Evans, presented $24,000 in scholarships to finalists in the Miss Oahu Filipina competition. But we think the students in this next segment are all winners too. By getting involved with student government, it gives one the opportunity to have the full student experience by getting involved with the community. One of my chosen legacies as an SGA member this year was to create, to help create some awareness of the different kinds of organizations, both locally and nationally, that are nonprofit organizations, um, ways in which we can give support um, to various companies that we specifically work with in the clinical psychology program. So for example, um, every month we have an awareness table that's set up and it has some cause that we bring awareness to and we provide in contact information, um, we take up donations, and every month that money is, is mailed off to that particular organization um, for fighting um, for AIDS awareness, for example. We raised over $500 um, and donated it to the Life Foundation here, which is a local organization in Hawaii. Um, eating disorders. Um, Men's Health Month is this month, and so it's just bringing awareness to the various different types of health issues. And one of our um, projects was our blood drive. One of the representatives at, in student body, um, she, her friend was the head of the blood drives here on Hawaii. And so we created a day, got in touch, and then we went out um, to Bishop Square and let everybody know that we were having a blood drive here and that we were helping support a great cause here in Hawaii. One way or another, I have been connected to my community um, since a child, since childhood. And whether that's rescuing animals or volunteering time, working with homeless shelters or um, being a crisis counselor online, um, I've always been connected to, emotionally connected to helping people. And being a psychologist in this field, that really gives me the opportunity to do it and get paid for doing it. One of my the other big interests, I'm also a state referee here in the state of Hawaii, and uh, I was just sent to the mainland to Salt Lake City, Utah for a national tournament. Um, in refereeing, I find that clinical psychology and psychology in general is just very helpful and letting the, the players know that I'm there and I'm watching and also that I, I'm seeing the good things that they do because when we blow the whistle, we're always telling them something wrong that they're doing. So I tend to say good play, uh, great soccer, and really talk to the players and use the psychology that I know.